Magni passes a stranger pointing gun fingers toward him before reaching his mother. As he picks up a hammer he sees a sign and feels a huge surge of power running through it. His mother takes the hammer away and Magni went inside. The next day we see Magni and Isild hiking through the mountains. They both encounter a warning sign. Magni asks Isild how long have she been in love with Soxa, and she replies always. He then says F her. He tells her that she is too good for Soxa. He then jumps over the warning sign. Magni then receives a message from Loritz saying their mom has a problem and she needs you. His phone battery then dies. He tells Isil that he has to go. Isil then tells him that she will glide back on her own. We then see Vider naked. He closes his eyes and when he opens them his eyes change to a demon-looking monster. He jumps off a high altitude, catches a deer, breaks its neck, and takes its heart out before leaving it to die. Isild reaches the top and sees a black cave. She enters and sees wires leading to a highly protected door. Outside she can hear the noises of Vider as he eats the deer heart and screams. Upon Magni's arrival back he notices that Loritz was lying about his mom, and she was okay. Magni then sees Isil gliding back. He notices she was heading to some electric wires and tries to warn her. It was too late she was executed. A car then stops containing Vider. They both tried to bring her back alive, but it was too late. Magni now walking home sad. He sees the hammer from earlier and throws it in the sky angrily. As he screams lightning starts to flash in the sky and all the electricity in the village went out.